guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a huge kind of spring, like Valentine's-y kind of haul. All these pieces are from Nasty Gal and it is a website that I've heard a lot about. I've tried a few bits and bobs from there but I've never kind of got a big boatload of stuff. But going on the website it was so easy to find multiple pieces that I like. Sometimes I go onto a website and I really struggle to kind of find things that I like. A lot of websites at the moment kind of aren't stocking things that are my taste. They're kind of more like cycling shorts and stuff like that and that's not my thing obviously uh so nasty girl has a lot of kind of more classy pieces pieces that i kind of gravitate towards and they're also kind of like some vintagey kind of boho vibes if you know what i mean you guys will definitely love the things that i've got to show you there's the the, the quality of these pieces are phenomenal they're really nice they all feel really really good quality and they feel like they've got a bigger price tag than they do these are all really really affordable pieces and if you haven't shopped Nasty Girl, then definitely try these out. All of these bits and bobs will be linked in the description for you guys to go and check out. Really do recommend it. They are all, uh, everything here I absolutely love. It's like my favourite kind of haul I've probably done for a while now. Everything here is just like top dollar. So I'm not going to ramble on too much. All I have to say to you guys, if there's anything that you like, it will all be linked in the description. And I'm just going to get straight on into it. So the first piece that I have, I think this could be a really cute kind of... Valentine's Day dress, I don't know, I think it's really pretty and it's not too in your face. Obviously it's got the red in it and it's got kind of like the pretty neckline and it's also got like some feminine buttons and I feel like it is a really kind of feminine dress and it is, it's got Valentine's Day vibes to me but it's not overwhelmingly. Um, it's just gorgeous, the quality of it is really nice, there's a zipper down the back so it's not a struggle to get into and then it buttons up the front as well and the buttons are really delicate. The sleeves are really pretty, they kind of poof up slightly, not like massively or anything like that, but only ever so slightly. And then it's kind of like, what would you call it? It's probably lands mid-calf, I haven't tried it on yet, as you can see the tags are still on it. And I got everything in a UK 8, just for sizing reference. This will probably land about mid-calf on me, I'd imagine, but you'll see on the try-on clips, and I am 5'7 for reference, so if you're shorter or taller, obviously you can figure that one out. But I really, really like this. I think it's just such an elegant piece and you can obviously wear... I think you could even kind of wear this with Doc Martens and kind of get a really cool vibe going on with like a really elegant dress and then some more like boyish boots. I think that's a really nice look. Uh, but if you did want to dress it up, you could wear maybe some red sandals to kind of match the colour if obviously it's warm where you live. Or even like some red boots. I used to have some red boots with a zip down the front. That would look gorgeous with this. But that is the first piece. So the next piece I have, I don't think you can see it too well because of the exposure. But you'll see it on the try and clip. It's kind of got a linen feel to it. I'm pretty sure it is made out of linen. And then it has this kind of ruched detail across the front. And then you can tie these two strings into a little bow. And then it's got a little peep at the back with like a tiny little pearl button which is so pretty. This is just so lightweight and gorgeous. I think with some kind of nude wedges that kind of match the same colour of this it could just be gorgeous I think it's obviously it needs ironing it's quite creased but I was going to say I'll iron it before I wear it but honestly I probably won't um, and then it's got these uh, tapered sleeves as well so it kind of gives you that ruching effect it's just gorgeous it's really really beautiful I just think it's such a simple piece but it's so elegant and I love dresses because you can just throw them on and not really think about anything else it's so easy to just throw a dress on and then maybe some nice earrings and you're good to go and look put together but this is just gorgeous. The cut, cut off length is amazing too, everything about it. And then I love the neckline as well. It's kind of like a square neckline which is a little bit different. I don't really have anything with this neckline so for me it's different and I think it's quite on trend at the moment, the, uh, the boxy neckline. I really like this piece. So the next piece I have, I absolutely love this. I love things like this. Again the exposure is a little bit too high. But it's just this white shirt with kind of like tortoise shell buttons and two pockets each side. And the material is so nice, it's kind of hard to explain. It almost feels like it's kind of water repellent, if that makes sense. Like, you know that coating that you get on things that makes it like really soft? It kind of feels like that. I don't know what the material is, um, but it's just really gorgeous. It's so nice, it's going to feel so nice on one of those really like soft and kind of luxurious pieces. It feels a lot more expensive than it is. And I just think it's gorgeous with a pair of uh, blue jeans and then some like wooden heeled sandals could look really nice or even flat shoes I just really really like this brown boots could look really nice with blue jeans I just love the look of blue jeans and a white shirt I just think it looks gorgeous um, and I know a lot of you guys feel the same and obviously it's oversized so it's not going to be like restricting and you don't have to worry about eating and like getting a food baby <laughs> so this is just like I love this if you know me you know I love this big tortoise shell sunglasses on your head gorgeous such a cute outfit this next piece I think is possibly my favourite 
I really, really like this. This is slightly out there for me because of the colour of it. I don't think I have anything this colour. But this really reminds me of a dress that Lana wore a few years ago in Italy. I think it was in Italy anyway. I'll put the picture on the screen now. I'm very, like, vaguely remembering it, but I think it's quite similar to this. And I remember looking at the dress and loving it and trying to find something similar. And to me, this kind of resembles the dress. It's got a lot of the same features. I just think this is going to be the most gorgeous thing ever on. I'm slightly worried that it will be a little bit too big. It is in a size 8, but to me it looks a little bit big. But sometimes things look bigger off than on, if that makes any sense. The colour of it is gorgeous. Again, it's kind of like a linen fabric. It's got the same coloured zip down the side so you don't even notice it. It's just gorgeous and it's got the same tortoise shell buttons down the front. I've actually got some wedges that I'll show you next to go with this because I just think it's so pretty. Again, if you're going somewhere for Valentine's Day, you could definitely wear this because this is just like gorgeous. I imagine it was like a low messy bun and then again like big sunglasses and even one of those uh, wicker handbags could look really nice. I really, really like this. I think it's definitely one of my favourite pieces. It's one of two that are my favourites and I think this is, I think this is pushing the bar. So the shoes I was just talking about are these ones. Now I have been looking for some wedges like this for a really long time, but I've been struggling to find them everywhere for some reason. I don't know if they've like, I don't know, they just seem to have vanished. These are gorgeous. They're, they're pretty much the exact same colour as my nails right now actually. So pretty. I just love these. Like the light pink with the kind of nude, like I just love it. It looks so nice. They're so like summery and I think they're just like really classy. You can even wear these with jeans and dress the whole outfit up. I just think it's really pretty but these with that pink dress I just showed you would look gorgeous. Um, but I know that these are going to last me for years because these don't really go out of style. Wedges like this have been like, you know, trendy for literally years now. And I don't really think you can go wrong with them. I think they're really, really nice. And obviously a lot comfier to walk in than stilettos or anything like that. And the quality of these is just like amazing it's got like a little rose gold uh, buckle to go with it the whole design thing is just cool so if you've watched any of my recent videos you'll know that i've been loving the i don't know if it's cheetah print or leopard print one of the two i've been really loving it and i saw this cardigan on nasty Al and i just thought it was gorgeous now if i'm honest i was apprehensive about the quality of this because you can get cardigans that are so scratchy i know that i've been to places like h&m and they're like really like itchy wool and it's horrible this is so soft. It's like a stretchy, soft wool. It's just absolutely gorgeous. The whole thing, the length of it is perfect. It's all like, I just love it. I think this can look so nice. Again, with like a white cami. I've kind of got an outfit in mind that I'll use in the try-on. With like a white strappy cami, blue jeans, and this could just look really nice. It's so easy to just throw on, and the quality of it is just gorgeous. It's got pockets. Everyone loves pockets. And it's just amazing. And the price tag for this was so reasonable for what it was. Because it was so inexpensive, I thought the quality would kind of match that. But the quality definitely goes further than the price tag. It's gorgeous. It's so well made. There's no loose threads or anything like that. It's literally, it's just like the perfect cardigan. I definitely need to check out more of Nasty Al's cardigans and kind of knitwear. Because this is like, so nice. So the next piece I've got is a navy tea dress. Now if you know me, you'll know that I love the colour blue and that I love tea dresses. I saw this and it was with a kind of cream cardigan, I think, on the website. And I just thought it looked gorgeous. I absolutely love it. I'm kind of imagining this with some brown leather boots and maybe even this cardigan to tie in the colours. I just think it could look so cute. I love tea dresses. I love the shape of them, the cut of them. And this is made out of like a jersey material. So it kind of calms down the outfit. It makes it more chill. Not so like out there. This is beautiful. I really like it. It's so wearable. You can wear it with tights. It's not a colour that would look odd with tights. I just think it's so gorgeous. And it can definitely be a more day-to-day -day piece. I definitely class this as a day dress. I just think it's gorgeous. The quality, again, is so nice. The buttons are nice. Everything is just so well made. I was really shocked, like, hand on heart, I was so shocked with the quality of everything. It's all, like, phenomenally made. You'd think it was, like, double the price that it is. I really need to shop more at Nasty Girl. <laughs> but this is just gorgeous. The ribbed effect, everything. Everything about this dress, I absolutely love. I just, I really like it. It's so wearable. The next piece that I got is slightly... When I say this is adventurous for me, I know a lot of people kind of roll their eyes and think, what? It's just a white dress. But for me, things like this are quite, like, girly, and I kind of find it a little bit hard to pull off that. 
Uh, but this, I really like the pattern. I like the square neckline. I think it looks really pretty. And again, with the little kind of spaghetti straps, it just looks really feminine and makes you look all like delicate on your decolletage. Again, it's got those tortoise shell buttons all the way down. And I really like the kind of, I like that it's a boxy dress. Like there's no like scoop necklines anywhere on this. It's quite boxy and straight, which I think is a little bit different. And I'm just trying to figure out what shoes to wear with this. I think even brown boots could kind of make it a little bit more casual and less dressy because I think this can easily become dressy but this with brown boots could really dress it down and maybe maybe even this cardigan actually that could look quite nice to kind of add some warmth to it but I just really like this dress and I can't wait to figure out how to style it the next piece I have is this gorgeous jumper now this is kind of like a camely nudie colour so I really like the v-neck shape that's going on here. It's just really like elegant and I like the way it just kind of flows down. The sleeves are really pretty. It's kind of got like trumpet sleeves and the knit is really good. There's no loose threads or anything like that. It's really soft. Again, it's not scratchy and it's kind of got a slight high-low thing going on at the hem. Uh, it's just really pretty. It's so easy to wear. This with, I think, white jeans could look really nice with like some suede nudie boots. I think it could look really nice. It's obviously a really simple outfit but I think you can really dress this up for like a more like a lunch date type thing you could dress it up to that or you could just wear it as a really casual outfit and it would look really pretty I love pieces like this because they're so versatile the next piece I got is a black bodysuit I love things like this because they're just so easy to throw on especially in summer you can just pop this on with like some blue jeans and then some like flip flops or sandals and you're just good to go because it's just so easy to wear it's so lightweight there's nothing like fancy about it, it's just like such a simple outfit to throw on, you don't need to think about it. I just really like this, the quality of it is really nice. It does have a thong bottom so you're not going to get like underwear lines. I don't know why anyone makes bodysuits with like a full, like no one wants that. This is perfect. I really like this, the leg holes don't come up too high so if you are wearing low waisted jeans, I only wear like, low waisted jeans so you won't be seeing like the leg hole or anything like that. This is just, it's such a simple piece, but again, you can kind of dress it up if you want to with a cardigan and like some hooped earrings. Um, I just think it's really pretty and really simple. And again, I love pieces like this because they're so versatile. You can even wear it underneath things to kind of add warmth. So the next piece I have is another one of my absolute favourites. This is something really, really different for me, but I also feel like it's, it's kind of trendy and also vintage at the same time. It's kind of got two things in one. I just think it's really, really beautiful, and I kind of I'm looking at more of the vintage side. I just really like it. It's got the coolest buttons ever. They're kind of like zebra print buttons. I just have supposed to be like that, but the way it's kind of been worked in, they've kind of got stripes across them. It's really nice, and then it's got this kind of like Lara Croft vibe to it, if you know what I mean. Like it's got the belt across, it's got the buttons all the way down. It's just really cool. It's really cool and really different. It's got some vintage kind of aspects to it, and it's also got some more modern pieces. Uh, it's got pockets, uh, which are so cool. I think it's got two sets of pockets, unless these are just for show. Yeah, it's got two pockets on each side, and then a belt that goes around the middle, and I just think this could look really, really pretty. I really, really like it. The quality is so nice. It's lightweight. I know it's going to be really comfortable because of the way it's been made. And it's kind of got like a dungaree style strap, if that makes any sense. Kind of like the way it's positioned and the thickness of it and everything. I just think it's really, really pretty. The cut of it and everything is gorgeous, and I really can't wait to try it on. So you guys have well seen the try and clip what this looks like, but I just think it could be like the most gorgeous thing ever. And I love how the belt kind of moulds into the dress because obviously there's a lot of detailing on it without it. It's just perfect. I really like this dress. So this is the last piece. It's kind of like a camely nude colour. It's going with like a darker, almost brown, I guess. It's just so pretty. This, again, is quite vintage to me. I don't know if I'm like right with that, but the skirt of it just kind of looks really vintage to me. And the kind of colour and the cut and everything just has a really like old fashioned feel. I really really like it. It's got uh, buttons on the sleeves as well, they're kind of like shirt sleeves. I just think this is gorgeous. It buttons all the way down and then it's got pleats towards the bottom. This does need ironing as well, I haven't ironed anything. Uh, so everything will need ironing before I actually wear it out. But the quality of this again is just so nice. There's no loose threads. Everything is just absolutely perfect and it's kind of like, it's not too heavy to the point it's uncomfortable but it's kind of heavy enough to let you know that it's good quality and also can be worn throughout all of the seasons. You could wear this in summer if you live in England uh, without tights and wouldn't get too hot I don't think uh, but this is just gorgeous. It's got seams down the back and everything. The attention to detail on all of these pieces is just amazing. I really really like everything and I just think the bottom of it is just so pretty. I love how it's kind of like smart at the top and it has kind of like a girly 
feel to it on the bottom. I don't know. I just really like it. I really, really like this piece. And it is the last thing I have to show you. So that is everything that I got from Nasty Gal. Be sure to check the links in the description if you like anything. I'm sure you get this so much here to love. Everything will be linked in the order that I've shown it to you. So if you like the red dress, it'll be the first link. And if you like the pink dress, it'll be the fourth link. So it's kind of in the order that it was displayed to so it'll be easy for you guys to find so yeah that's pretty much it from me i hope you guys found a little bit of inspiration maybe you found something to wear kind of on valentine's day or throughout the spring i just think there are so many gorgeous pieces here and i really can't wait to try them all on and wear them out because i just think all this stuff is just like me to a T. Like I could have designed all of this stuff. It's just so well fitting. So that's all I have to say to you guys. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to comment below what your favourite piece was from the haul. Because I'm really curious to know. Because I can't decide whether this is my favourite piece or this is. So let me know what yours is throughout the whole haul. And yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.